And we're back. We're gonna do a reading. This is gonna be a great day. It's gonna be a great day. It's Friday. It's the weekend. If you guys have any plans, definitely go out and do whatever it is that you do. We're gonna clear the air. Cool, I'm feeling it. <sighs> Man, okay, this is good, this is good. Let's just go with the flow here. We're gonna see what spirit has to say. This wire, oh, okay. I am here, I am present, ready to send a message to the collective. Anyone who needs to know anything, thank you for the prosperity and all these wonderful things that are happening. Now I need a message. I need a clear message. I don't need distractions. You see the distractions? The distractions are what everyone gets distracted for, you know? Okay. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? I'm just gonna pull some cards and we'll see what happens. Tapping into my conscious energy, my heightened awareness, not allowing any negative vibes to intervene and prevent the flow. Haha! -ha. Somebody is rising from the ashes. Look at this. <laughs> okay, that's weird. So I had a six, seven, and eight pop out. However, the eight was first, eight of diamonds. So somebody is, somebody's finding peace with themselves or someone else, or trying to remain peaceful in a stressful situation when they come in contact with someone that they were previously involved with and they realize they don't want to be involved with them anymore. I could be speaking to you or perhaps someone in your vicinity. However, I have a six of clubs pop out right after the six of spades and seven of spades. So that's a progression, a good progression. This is a weird energy. It feels tight. It feels like just growing pains. Five, six, seven, eight. I have a perfect straight here. good change that's a good change for you and then five on the bottom five of hearts so it's a change in love oh that's great let's just oh yes a change in love and here's another five this is the other five of spades are you paying attention we got a nine of hearts which lets us know there is a Good change in love, a progression in love, a more open kind of love. Maybe not so micromanaging or anything that other people may have been doing. Yeah, two nines in a row, so that's good. I see that as a good sign, because I'm feeling that perhaps there was a little bit of um, deceit. Perhaps some lying, some deceitful behavior. Can't have that. Confirming with the seven. <sighs> you gotta get out of that. Eventually you're gonna have love. There's the love. Okay, is there anything else that we need to get rid of? Because these energies are just not cool. <laughs> queen of hearts popping out. I know you wanna come out, babe. I know you want the queen of hearts. You are the queen of hearts. 
Don't wander too far into Alice and Wonderland. Don't far, wander too far into Wonderland. I'm trying not to get pulled back myself, but that's the other eight of hearts. And usually whenever I get this one, it means that there's a good, good sense of love, a good uh, abundant infinite infinity and beyond. Ace and a two. What? This is all messed up. Seven. There's a jack of spades. So there's someone who's still overworking themselves. Realizing that they don't have to work so hard. Stop working so hard. You don't need to, sometimes you gotta relax. However, once you get into that state of flow, it feels almost calm and kind of effortless. So it starts to feel like you should be adding some resistance in there. Why is this so easy? This shouldn't be so easy. Where is the resistance? And that's where you just need to like take a step back and realize that there doesn't, there is no more resistance. Cause this is the new lifestyle that you've cultivated for yourself. You know, the, um, manifestation process and all that. So now you're you're at this point where you're just like, I've never been here before, so I don't know how to react. I'm gonna react how I usually react, which is to act out. I guess, yeah. Ancestors, do you have anything for the collective? I don't really, uh, I wasn't even going to record today. I hate saying stuff like that. Usually I just, if I do it, I do it. I don't, I don't. But we had a four clubs pop out, which is a, a good, good amount of uh, releasing has been done already. According to the ancestors, all the releasing has been done. There's just excitement now. It's just this expectation for the potential of the future and the optimism that something good is going to happen. That's good. I like it. Let's stay positive. That's how you, how you keep things flowing. That's how you keep things in alignment. Even if it feels like the world is crashing around you, it's just like you gotta stay peaceful. You just gotta remain non-responsive. I mean, unless you want to respond to it, unless it's something that has benefited you in the past to respond to, but if it's, you know, used, used to hurt you and it's not so healthy for you anymore, perhaps you should try something a little different. We had a four on the bottom to follow this four of clubs. So there's two four of clubs there. So that's, that could be good. That's significant for someone. Oh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. Y'all gotta go visit my shop. Go visit my Shopify store. Go buy some things. Go pick yourself out something nice. Yeah, like it. I have a link tree now. It's so simple. Link tree is so simple. I don't know why everyone doesn't use it. All my links are right there. I'll put, a, uh, I'll put a link for you to my link tree for all my other links in the description. <laughs> oh my goodness. Ah. Okay. Two of spades, I mean two of clubs with a four of diamonds. This is a lot of good luck. Whoever's worried, stop being worried. There's gonna be a lot of fun for you. A lot of like going to the beach and car rides and hanging out and watching movies and eating popcorn and watching Netflix, two and four. So you're gonna come in union with someone that you feel comfortable with or something. I'm just feeling that. I'm feeling, I'm just, that's just like my direct line. Like that's how I see it. Now there's gonna be someone separating from old habits or old identities or old attachments in the form of it could be a relationship or maybe just like a mortgage or a financial tie or something like that but it's changing for you it's gonna be better it's gonna be like a turn in a different direction it might not change like the numbers themselves like let's say you want financial stability and it might not come in the form of a million dollars in the bank but maybe it'll come in the form of somebody helping you with your bills or 
a bill getting a lower payment or something refinancing a house stuff like that like it does always have to be like uh, 1.5k million in the bank like that's good to aspire for but that's it's gonna take time that's gonna take time you gotta take it one step at a time go for the small things first and then you'll work your way up that's usually how it works one step at a time people don't overwhelm yourself five of yeah it's going in the right direction this five of uh, uh, diamonds just lets me know it's good for the pentacles your money's good you got the value everything's fine now you just gotta have the confidence to actually go forth and make all these things happen because it's changing for you and the nine of nine of uh diamonds with the queen of diamonds and the king of hearts and the two and the ten <sighs> this is this is a good power couple union where it's give and take, yin and yang. Get all the pentacles and just fun little day sitting on the beach, drinking a Corona, soaking up the sun. Two people. Ugh. You see how my cards have gotten more sporadic? It's just how it is now. See, there's another king on the bottom just to confirm all that. Oh my goodness eight this is good this is a good amount of energy let's keep it up let's keep it up guys let's not let's not falter too far because sometimes when when uh, other temptations that used to tempt us come in you think huh is that still some, some, some sometimes you don't even get tempted by it you just think oh I'm strong enough to handle that now so maybe I should just go hang out and do those things and I could just I could drink that six pack because you know I'm <laughs> I'm not who I used to be you could I mean, I, it, it gets to the point almost where things like that don't really satisfy you anymore, or you don't even crave them. That's cool. Ah, I love it. All right, okay, okay. So we're gonna go with this deck and see if there's any more things that need to be released out of the energy field, aside from the daily cleanses. We gotta have a balance. So, ancestors, oh guys I need some assistance in the voice department help the ones that are struggling in different ways however however they need help and if it's rough if it's rough at the beginning it's go it's good that's good you see that as a sign that it's working because it's supposed to be a sign that it's working if you don't give up it'll actually be worth it because then you'll get past you'll get past all of the uh things that were holding you back previously because you you know overcome the boundary Whew. yeah you've overcome the boundary now so everything is running smooth for you and you just gotta stay persistent and not let creeping thoughts come back in and be like are you sure what are you doing what are you doing with your life you're throwing your life away <laughs> actually i'm not <laughs> but you know thanks for your concern I don't need it. Just worry about yourself. It's crazy. Some people worry more about other people than themselves. And it's just so much worry and doubt and fear and anxiety. Just get rid of it. Yeah, we got a, a lot amount of love. All, all of that prevents the love from coming in. If you're just anxious, paranoid, and don't let anybody in because you're just paranoid. You're just paranoid. You know, that's just who you are. So you just decide to be paranoid. It's like, oh, I'm just paranoid. Okay, well, do you want to be paranoid? Is that what you enjoy? The universe seems to think so. That's why they keep giving it back to you. So perhaps you should uh, try to be a little less paranoid because you are a queen and you have assertive energy that if you were to walk into a gas station and be like, everyone might turn and look at you. I don't know why I said gas station. A room full of people and everybody turns and looks and they're like, oh, wow, who's that? Are they going to wreak havoc? But you don't. You see, you could, but you don't. That's what makes you a queen. <laughs> I don't really know what other messages. Oh, of course. Yeah, since you are coming into your queen status, you are realizing that you, <laughs> you can uh, get AI technology to do your job and you can go live your life and do something better. 
go to the beach and just hang out and see the water. Exactly. King King, two kings, in case you didn't see that. Hit that subscribe button, join the clan. If you would like to leave a donation, I definitely appreciate it. Full force, every bit of it. This is a good, this is good. <sighs> I love it. I love it. Two people, whoever these two people are, I hope y'all are happy together and I hope y'all find each other. There's an infinite amount of um, good things coming for you. So just stay patient. Persistence is key. Don't forget who you are or where you came from. Because sometimes you could be asking for something and it could be right in front of your face all along and you don't see it because you're just focusing on what you think it should be. When in reality, it's actually better, better, <laughs> better than what you thought it was in every aspect. Why? <laughs> Do you see that? Do you see that? Oh, spirits, thanks for that confirmation. Now that I've got all these cards on the table, <laughs> we're going to try for actually a deck I haven't used on camera, I don't think. This is a. I have used these once. <laughs> split on a king and an ace so there's a lot of love and money and abundance and prosperity and it's like not even a surprise at this point the way these cards just keep popping out like this this is this is a fantastic i just love it oh my goodness give me a card to confirm the fact that someone's about to come into riches and wealth and prosperity and love because that's just all the good things right the love will come after the no the money will come after the love because then you'll realize <laughs> it opens you up to better possibilities. One more. <sighs> of course. The great king of spades. Followed by the ten on the bottom. <laughs> what happened to this? Oh. Cool. Well, look, look, because this is good. I'm, I'm loving this. This is good. There's king. There's not only queen stats.